Hello everyone! Summer is definitely a time where people are looking to try new and different products, whether it's because they're curious or because their skin just needs something different. I've laid out everything from a cleanser to moisturizer to a body product that I think are all great for summer. These are all things that I've been using regularly and really, really loving. I also want to say thank you to Fresh because I am making this video in partnership with them. They have been one of my all-time favorite skincare brands for a really long time and if you watch my videos then this is no secret. the Drunk Elephant Juju Facial Bar. I have also been using the Peaky Bar, which is amazing, but I think this one in particular is great for summer because it really deep cleanses your skin and you also get a gentle exfoliation as well. So what I do is I put this in my hands underneath the faucet, I lather it up a little bit, and then I just put it on my face. You get a really fluffy, luxurious lather from this and it's just satisfying to use. And when I rinse this off, I feel like my skin is really smooth and soft and it's also clean, but it doesn't feel stripped. The only downside to this is that it can be difficult to travel with because it is a facial bar. So you have to like put it in something like this or have a little travel container for it. But other than that, I really love using the Juju bar. I just think it is so awesome. I've noticed a difference in my skin and it's just also like a nostalgic product to use. This is the Fresh Black Tea Kombucha Facial Treatment Essence. This is actually my second bottle because I loved it so much that I flew through it. So you can already see that I'm making some progress on this one. The reason why I have loved using this product is because this is one product with so many different benefits. It's packed with antioxidants and it fights pollution. I'm usually in a city environment and that means there's going to be more pollution around and if you pay attention to your skin when you are in these kinds of environments, your pores get clogged and you can see the dirt in your pores. Or if you just wash your face at the end of the day and you're using a cotton pad, you can see the dirt that just hangs around on your face when you're walking around just going about your day. This is especially great for me because I wanna do as much as I can to protect my skin from pollution. I also really love the texture of this product. I'll actually, pour it out. I have a little bit in my hands here and it's dripping. It has a really light silky texture and when you put this on your face it just feels so refreshing and incredible. The scent is also really lovely. I can smell the black tea in it, which I really like. One of the things that I love about Fresh products is that their fragrances are always so thoughtful and they're really pleasant. I use this morning and night after I cleanse my skin and it immediately makes my complexion more luminous and it's proven to increase moisture as well. I think this is a great product year round, but especially for summer because it's a really light and refreshing way to add hydration into your skin. It's also going to add glow and because you're typically outside more in the summer, it helps fight pollution as well. This is definitely one of my favorite skincare discoveries of the entire year. And something that I will actually do with this if I want a little bit more hydration, I will put on a few layers of this. This is the Huxley Secret of Sahara Oil Essence. And I have really been liking this because this is like an oil and serum all in one, but I think it leans a little bit more on the serum-y side. It has a little dropper and I'm gonna put a little bit on my hand here. It has a pretty thick texture to it, which is why I think it leans more on the serum side, but I can definitely feel like the light oil quality to it. The reason why I like this is because one, it smells amazing. It has this really fresh, almost slightly florally scent to it, but I think it's really lovely. It quickly absorbs into your skin and makes your skin feel really supple and plump. Plump is just one of my favorite words. I don't know why I love the sound of the word plump. It just like makes me really happy. This feels really good on the skin. I just use a couple drops of this and then I pat it onto my face. It has made my complexion brighter over time. I can use it morning and night. So there's that kind of flexibility. And if you're someone that doesn't like to wear traditional moisturizers in the summer, this is something 
something that you could layer up and you will get the moisture that you need. If you're looking for something that's going to brighten your complexion, not leave any kind of greasy residue on your skin, this is definitely it. Now, if you really want a moisturizer, I am going to recommend the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Pink Juice Moisturizer. This is perfect, especially for people that have oily or combination skin, although I do think that it could work for other skin types, especially if you are using things like an essence and a serum or an oil underneath. If you have used the Glow Recipe Watermelon Mask, this smells exactly like the mask. It actually has a fairly similar consistency too. So there's a pump, makes it really easy and sanitary to use. I love the packaging. It's reminiscent and consistent with the Watermelon Glow Mask, which I love. When you put this on, if you have used that mask, it really feels pretty similar. It's just kind of like a light version of the mask. And this feels instantly cooling on the skin. I don't think that I have used a moisturizer that feels cooling like this one. You feel it the moment you start to blend it out on your skin. It absorbs really quickly. It makes your skin feel supple. You can use makeup over the top and you don't have to worry about little clumps forming. It completely absorbs. It's not leaving a residue behind so you can wear this with or without makeup. It is just like the ultimate summer moisturizer. And if you like the mask, then you will really like this moisturizer. And the First Aid Beauty Ginger and Turmeric Vitamin C Jelly Mask. So this is really a jelly mask. It looks like jam. You can really smell the ginger and the turmeric in this. So if you don't like those scents, then this is not for you. This is a mask that I keep in the refrigerator for an extra cooling effect, but even if you don't keep it in the refrigerator, this still is very cooling. And I just put a layer all over my face. I leave it on for like 10 minutes and it just makes your skin feel really cool and it also helps to brighten your complexion. If you're looking for something that's going to be easy to use that isn't harsh on the skin but does brighten, sometimes brightening masks can irritate your skin and I would say this is definitely more on the gentle side. I think this is a great option. Another mask that I keep in the fridge at all times is the Fresh Rose Face Mask. By the way, let me know if you would like to see a video on all the beauty products that I I keep in the fridge because I keep an astonishing amount of beauty products in the fridge. When people open up my fridge, they're like, oh, what, what is that? I have loved this for a long time and I think that this is a great mask, especially for summer. So I've used this mask when I've had like a sunburn on my face or even if I don't, but I think that this is great because it's hydrating, it's really cooling, especially when you keep it in the fridge and it soothes your skin. And in the summertime, that's typically what I want out of a face mask. I want something that's gonna soothe my skin after being outside in the hot weather. If I have a sunburn, I wanna put on something that feels good. This mask also has a gel consistency to it and I think masks like this are amazing for summer. My face likes this if I have a sunburn on my face, but your skin may not. So definitely try it out in a small area if you have any kind of irritation happening on your face first. This is especially great to use in the morning too. When you wake up and you pull this out of the fridge, I love putting this like around my eye area. It just feels so good. I wanted to include a body product because I feel like this is something that can get overlooked in the summer. I still like to hydrate my skin, but sometimes the moisturizers that I use during the rest of the year just feel sticky in the summertime, especially if I'm in humidity. So I have been using the Tatcha Indigo Soothing Silk Body Butter. This is the best body butter that I have ever used, and I've used a lot of body butters. When I dip into this, the consistency feels like a body butter, but it instantly just melts into your skin. It feels really light, but also very, very hydrating. And that's exactly what I want in the summertime. I want something that's still going to deliver hydration, but I don't want something that's going to feel sticky. 
and I love that it goes from that thick body butter texture and the minute it touches your skin it just melts this is such a wonderful product to use it's definitely a splurge for a body product especially but I like to treat myself on Sundays in particular and just like slather this all over my body but it's also something that I will use during the week as well and I think that this is an awesome option if you are looking for something that is going to be very hydrating but it's not going to feel sticky or greasy. It smells like I'm standing on the beach breathing in the fresh air and I just love the entire experience of this product. It really is an experience. All right so that is everything. If you have any questions for me please leave them down below in the comments and if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell button so you can get notified when I post a new video. Thanks for watching everyone. I will see you guys later. Bye!